The only thing we can start it off with, really, because Chewbacca doesn't like to be pushed back. He he's like, you cannot bury this lead. If you do, I will chainsaw you in half. And so I do what he says. And that is the Chewbacca Chainsaw of the Week Award. <laughs> and this week, the award goes to... We need to get a drum roll. That's what we need to do. We, a drum we, roll? I know a drummer. We already have a Chewbacca with a chainsaw. Like I don't think a drum roll is really adding anything to this one. I think every good show needs a drum roll, and I know a drummer who can record the said roll for us. So, hey, Tuesday night special, me. Alex. That's you, buddy. That drummer. That's uh, that's you, Alex, buddy. Tuesday is night that our special. Guy from from Tuesday night special. Yeah. Tuesday night special. That's it. And I don't know why we're hyping this group because they're broken up now. So. We're actually our theme song was the last official thing that they the did together for for our song. They made our song and then they broke up. It's I it's like you know the greatest artists. You know they always die before they become really famous. So this group just broke up before they became famous because that theme song was amazing and it will make them famous whether they like it or not. I hope they like it. But so this week's Chewbacca being famous. <laughs> so this week's Chewbacca Chainsaw Award goes to uh, a very nice young woman. And I should actually say girl. And normally you would say, no, no, you should say young woman. No, but this girl's 11 years old, and that is Lucy Lee. She just qualified for the U.S. Women's Open in golf. And she's the youngest person to ever do so. So that is a major event in golf that an 11-year-old qualified for. That That's pretty amazing. Um, although I'm I'm not as surprised as I, I might be. It was It was like... Oh man, actually, you know what? It's probably been ten years since there was a uh, there was another uh, young woman that was actually a young woman. She was like sixteen or something at the time. Michelle Wee. She was actually thirteen when she qualified. Oh, thirteen. Yeah, I remember. And, her and actually, trying um, to qualify. A cool thing about this story is is that um, the, actually there was the record was broke again for the youngest woman to qualify for the U.S. Women's Open, and by a couple months, like she was like 12 years old or something. And that was actually a teammate went to the same golf school as this girl who just broke the record. So, wait, wait, wait. Okay, so if this is just for the the Women's Open because I think that's uh, a few years. What was it? Back when I was the 10 years ago, she was going for. I don't remember her qualifying, although I'm sure she did at some point, but she was. Uh, competing for not just the the women's open, but just the PGA standard. Um, oh yeah, Michelle Wee was on the tour for a while, and she she did. I mean, she's kind of faded now, but I mean, who really knows anything about women's golf? So after she hit over sixteen, they're like, oh well, it's not so much a story. She's not that young anymore. So let's go find even younger. But I mean, this girl is actually still in elementary school. Uh, she was in. I don't believe she's graduated fifth grade yet. So. Uh, you know what? You get the Chewbacca Chainsaw of the Week Award. Yeah. So, yeah. And perhaps more to come if, you know, if she's starting at 11. Yeah, well, uh, yeah, well, let's hope this isn't her, her peak. <laughs> no one wants to peak at 11. That's the worst pace to peak ever. It's like, I reached the top of the mountain when I was 11, and I can never get back. Womp womp. Sad. <laughs> But let's move it on.